What's going on, everybody? Now, in this video, we are not going to be talking about Unreal Engine 5 because I know y'all are sick of it. Psych. Okay, so, as y'all know, Unreal Engine 5, right now, you can't nanite, it's a term, a skeletal mesh. So, you're probably wondering, well, gee whiz, how did they do it in the Valley of the Asians? Because the ancient one, the giant, was actually nanite. So how did they do it? Well, I am going to talk to you a little bit about how they did it, or at least I think they did it in this video. And then we are going to try and destroy my 3090 by spawning the ancient one. It's going to be awesome. All right. So like always, if you don't see me upload anything for a while, it's because my RTX 3090 is gone. So let's begin. So I have here the same exact project, the value of the ancient. And I just created a new level by just going to new level here because I want to start from scratch. And what I'm going to do is pull our giant guy here. So how did they do this? How did they pull off this amazing quality bad guy, right? I mean, look at this. And if I go to the nanite visualization, you see the triangles. Oh, yeah, he definitely is nanite, nanitable, nanitness. See it? So how did they do that? Well, what they did was actually they took a simple skeletal mesh. So it is a skeletal mesh. It's it the main bones. Well, the main frame is a skeletal mesh. Okay, so. I'm going to try and see if I can find it here. Yeah, right here. So this is the actual skeletal mesh. This is it. This is the same exact one. You're looking at it. But what they did was in a blueprint, they added and put on a crap ton of static meshes and pretty much gorilla glued it on the ancient one, which is brilliant. It's so simple. Well, the, the way they did it is probably not simple in that saying, but but it's like, okay, so how do we solve this problem? We can't nanite a skeletal mesh. Okay, well, let's just put a bunch of static meshes on there. So if I click on the pieces right here, you see that they're all different pieces gorilla glued to that skeletal mesh that I showed you. Freaking brilliant. It's simple, but it works. So I'm thinking like, hey, you know what? That character from Final Four... Or Fantastic Four, he's made of rocks. I could probably do the same thing. I can grab a, grab a skeletal mesh, go into Blueprint, and just assign a bunch of rocks on him, and he's going to look incredible, you know? Or like a Gollum character. Slap a bunch of static meshes on him that's nanite, and it's going to look awesome. So this is a skeletal mesh actor. This is the same thing, but from what it looks like, is they slapped a bunch of of static meshes on there. You see it? So if I delete this here, and I delete this here, I'm gonna show you something. So if I go to tools, they move this by the way, it was in Windows. Go to audit, statistics. Right now, our try count in some try, I have 4,064, okay? I'm gonna drop in our little dude right here and watch what happens. Statistics, refresh. Boom, 904,824, and now our total is 905,784. So this guy is packed. All right? And I'm going to save this because dad, okay? I guess, why did I type dad? That was weird. I typed like three letters and it made dad. Okay, so now you probably know where we're getting with this. Now we're going to try and spawn as much as we can with this person now we're going to do instances obviously so because this is just one mesh that's going to get instance i'm going to copy and paste them so let's create a bigger landscape oh this is going to take a minute because he is a bp so i'm going to try and copy and paste him all right 
Now, if you know an easier way to do this, now I can do this with fo foliage, foliage, foliage. Man, I'm getting a lot of correction for that word. There's a lot of English teachers on my channel. So here we go. You just got to know, though. Like, English is my third language. So, you know, I'm not, I'm not making excuses or anything, but some stuff I just can't pronounce. All right. We're here and we're back. Well, what happened? Why is he buried? Okay, there we go. What's up? So, my hands started hurting. And I was only able to do 100 ancient ones. So this is 100... I had to turn down the screen percentage, but we can turn that back up to like 200. And then we got a uh, echo here. Man, this is not even. This is crazy. Because technically, I still keep going. Look at the triangles here. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> That's so cool. I tried copy and pasting it, like selecting all of them and copy and pasting it, and I I got a blue screen of death. So, but this is, this is awesome. So technically you can nanite a skeletal mesh. You just got to put, you got to fill it up with, um, fill it up with static meshes. This is so cool. But yeah. If you guys have any questions, let me know, and I'll see you guys later. So you want to make a movie in Unreal Engine 4 using the new meta-human characters, but don't know how to do it? Well, I got the video just for you.